Hi, my name is Dan Morsey from the Avaya 1X Backbone Engineering team. This short video will walk you through some basic programming for the Avaya 1X Agent 2.5. We will also cover auto answer configuration. The following is considered to be the basic programming requirements for the Avaya 1X Agent to successfully register as an IP station. So the first thing we need to do is make sure that we have administered a supported phone type, which is a 2400 series, a 4600 series, a 6400 series, or a 9600 series. We need to make sure the station has a valid security code. Next, under Display, System Parameters, Customer Options, we need to ensure that we have the IP Stations field set to Yes. Next, we need to make sure that these minimum required buttons are present. After call, auto in, manual in, release, and aux work with a blank reason code. Multimedia mode set to enhanced. Service link mode as needed. Depending how you use the 1X agent, for ACD calls, you will need a user type agent. And this uses the IP agent license type. Depending on your various features that you require, you will need specific licensing for. To log in as a non-ACD agent, you will need the IP non-agent license, and you will need IP soup fee for supervisor type login. Voice over IP or my computer mode require IP agent release nine, and the 1X agent in desk phone mode requires the agent SC license type. The following is considered a basic auto answer configuration. In order to enable auto answer on the 1X agent, we need to change the communication manager settings in two places. The first, the agent login ID needs to be set to station for the auto answer setting. And the second place is on the station setting, we need to change this auto answer to either ACD or all. Under the system settings login tab, we need to make sure CM auto answer support required is checked. And under the work handling tab, the advanced, we need to make sure that the manual accept is highlighted. Alternatively, if the CM auto answer support required is unchecked, then your work items must be set to an auto accept. If you do not wish to use auto answer, then you would set the agent ID to none, the station ID to none, uncheck CM auto answer support required, and select manual accept. Thank you for your time today. We welcome comments, questions, and feedback at mentor at avaya.com or on Twitter at Avaya Mentor. For more details or related information, please visit support.avaya.com. Thank you for choosing Avaya.